Hey Cast Iron fans, I just had to share this with you. This is John and I was at the estate sale yesterday. I went to an estate sale and I picked this up right here. This is a Griswold number 9 6 quart Dutch oven. Uh, it's got the self basting lid. I always like Griswold because it's got the big uh, the emblem. Sometimes it's big, sometimes it's small. I always forget which is which. This was patented in 1920 Erie, Pennsylvania. It's a 2552 lid. That's a self-basting lid, by the way. In very good shape. The lid looks like it was never refinished. Looks like it's in really good shape. It got a little bit of, little bit of surface rust on there. Nothing major. Um, inside, real clean. And I haven't done anything to this. This is exactly how it came from the estate sale. And on the outside here, got a little action. Uh, it looks like it probably got rusted on the outside. And then the bottom, bottom's got some grime build up and stuff, so I don't know if I'll ever actually cook in this. Kind of bought this more for my own uh, personal satisfaction. I had a piece of Griswold at one point, and then I think I sold it for some reason. I don't, I don't exactly remember why. It might have been a really small pan. I usually don't keep small pans. Um, but when I saw this, kind of had to have it, you know. It's in really great shape. And that's the beauty of cast iron. I mean, this thing, even though it's probably 100 years old or at least close to, uh, it's never really an antique because it's always still usable as long as you can clean it up and season it. So I thought I'd share that with everybody, all you people out there who are interested in old vintage cast iron. I'm pretty excited about it, I have to admit. I don't know, maybe I'll cook on it. If you think there's something I should cook on it, leave a comment below. Um, but yeah, 85 bucks. I'm not disappointed.